morning, you guys. Welcome to our morning routine. Welcome. No, the truth is, it's like this. Yeah. I get all the kumot and what? I get cold legs. Okay, that's it. And then we wake up and then we go back to sleep for a few more minutes. We snooze 50, 100 times. But sometimes when she's really tired, she'll just DJ the alarm. That's it. So sometimes I just it, like toot, toot, and then she'll be like, wait, what? Why didn't we wake up? And I wouldn't hear it because she, she was she, she would be so fast to stop the alarm. alarm. Not even snooze. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. You usually set three alarms, right? Yeah. Me, I, I do too. We usually wake up between 8 to 9 a.m. But it depends on the day. Like today, we're extra tired because we came from a hike. And then we did lots of errands yesterday, pa. Very <laughs> usually, she sneezes on me. I'm gonna go change now. Bye. Around 9.30, we have Wolverine. <laughs> Wolverine. Hey, where are you? What, dude? Oh. Training. What dog? What dog? <laughs> what dog? What dog? What dog? What dog? Get up. Up, up, up. She's in baby mode. In <laughs> baby mode. Sit. Sit. Bang! 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 Good girl. Good girl. So usually it's like this. She lays there, waits for a zillion more snuggles. But I gotta go, Willow. I'm going outside now. I don't know if you guys can tell, but she doesn't even move. She's like, you don't wanna go down? No. She ain't about that life. About that aircon life. Right. Okay. Peace out. <laughs> no. We're gonna make a smoothie. No, I need, gonna I, need, a smoothie. I need water, Mona. Oh, oh no. Please, no. Hey, no. Could you spare me some droplets? <laughs> water so you can make me a smoothie. Thank you. So usually when I wake up, I wake up with like hunger. Don't move, man. I'm oh, sorry. I wake up with almost like hunger pain. Like my stomach really hurt. Moved again. Oops. It's really important that I drink um, a lot of water first thing every time I wake up. Make a smoothie. So I like to start my day by fueling myself with a lot of good nutrients like protein, fibers, um, healthy Target. fat. Because I feel like when you start your day healthy, you continue that day healthy, bitch. Like, you know how, for example, <laughs> if morning. you... It's a big Good morning. Good morning, Target. Good morning, Target. So yeah, if you start your day healthy, you end your day healthy. So you start it with a lot of snuggles. But before I take my smoothie, I started taking this one thing. It's really good for my gut health. I used to have the worst time digesting. And I know like when you think of probiotics or gut health, everyone thinks of your fault, bitch. But that just makes me fat. As good as it is for probiotics, it is not such a good like healthy supplement. Because it has animal dairy and a lot of sugar. Like I used to call your cold sugar milk. So I found this thing. By the way, excuse my face. Like this really be that way this morning. But this is from Life Space. It's the broad spectrum probiotic. It supports your everyday like gut system. A good gut gives good immunity and a good healthy gut stops you from bloating. What I love about this one is that it has no dairy and no gluten and it's not sugary it's literally just a little pill that i've been taking for a couple weeks now i don't know if you guys can tell but this is what it looks like it's just super small in the shade white if you've got like digestion problems intestinal problems this is a great solution it's a pretty mild solution but for me it goes a long way already honestly though i love that it's such a small I love that it's such a small pill because it's so easy to swallow like you're not like 
than doing. It's also super important to remember that 70% of your immunity comes from your gut. Especially now during the pandemic, I feel like it's really good to monitor your health, maintain a healthy body, a sexy hot girl summer body. And this is one of my great ways to do that because it really helps me with my bloating and my digestion. Also, I heard, I'm not constipated, but I heard that if you are constipated, this really helps a lot with that too. They said that if you are constipated, take one to two pills a day to solve that solution. It's a pretty mild solution, but it really helps out. I'm not constipated. For me, it's really about my gut health and my digestion. Aside from the fact that it solves like a variety of intestinal gut problems, it also contains 15 strains of beneficial bacteria for your your digestive system so I just take literally one a day it is vegetarian completely dairy free gluten free it has no artificial colors or flavors no eggs in it so I super stand this like it literally changed my life ever since I've started taking this I've been posting these photos of myself and a lot of people were asking how I de bloated and I think it really stemmed from good gut health and it was when I started taking this when my friends recommended it I think you guys should really take it too also they're made in Australia so you know that it's legit bitch and it is the number one probiotic brand in Australia so yeah check this out if you guys do have more questions feel free to comment down below or DM me about it I'm about halfway through my bottle so I will update you guys how I feel like after I finish the entire bottle but yeah I'll let you guys know. What smoothie are you gonna make for me today? A seed smoothie. All seeds. I don't think that's a smoothie. It's a pudding. So we're gonna <laughs> make a smoothie for you. Can you please hold no, it? for you too. Yes, well, for both of us. Um, we're gonna start off with... We got Elmhurst almond milk. This is probably my... Elmhurst? Elmhurst? Hurst? Almond milk this is like my favorite almond milk right now. It has more calories than what's that? Silk, almond breeze, whatever. But it is so creamy. I just get regular soy. Soy, soy is good too, actually. Anything that doesn't have dairy. Yeah. We try to go for like we're pescatarian by the way for any new subscribers, but we try to go for more vegan options if available. Like if Meron, we'll choose that. Fish we just can't let go because of sushi, period. I'm sure there are people who like, you can like go sushi, but it's okay to kill fish. Give me a Whoa. break, bitch. Give me a fucking break. It's all about um, what you can take, right? Yeah, and, and what you can the do to help. that we like. And what you can do to help. Also, I feel like being vegan is so expensive and I can't afford to be entirely vegan right now. I mean, I could. But I'm going to do a tofu. Yeah. <laughs> also, I use whey from Whale Nutrition Co. I've been using this for over a year now, no? Yeah. Actually, if you want to like try this for the first time, we suggest to get the vanilla first. Para marami kong magawa, para maganda siyang base. Yeah, for anything, like for any anything. fruit. Pero my favorite ultimate flavor from them is milk the melon tea. milk. Oh, melon milk. milk. The milk tea is also good. They have a boba milk tea flavor. When you mix it with vanilla and a few or other... caramel. Salted caramel. Looks smells so Salted caramel is the best. But the melon milk is my favorite because do you guys remember the one from Nestle dati? Sobrang sarap nun dati. What? Two's in it? Yung melon milk ng Nestle. Wala na siya. Pero sobrang sarap niya dati. Anyway, mm -hmm. do some of that. Then we throw in like half an apple maybe. <laughs> Yeah, and we can. Wait, I'll cut this. She's always like this. She rushes. Like, you know, we're murdering the apple. Okay, fine, we'll cut. I'll do it, man. Wow. I'm not going to cut it. I'm not going to cut it. I'm not going to cut it. We put the banana. And last, we put a little flaxseed. A little bit, just, just a little bit. This also helps with, like, constipation. I mean, I take the probiotic thing, but. I just also like a little flax seed. It's good for fiber. But the lagging the one toa ha. Tiknano, lagi ko na rin ni. Ano? Damn good for fiber. True and true. Can you see? I'm gonna blend this now. Dude, can I see? Kaya siya, eh, kaya siya. All right, P blender. All right, P. The this is this blend is gonna last you a year. It's yeah, actually been with me for a few years. Can it close? Yeah, it's it so gross. You're just, you're just pushing it down with your hands. R.I.P. 
That's Posi. your last mm -hmm. year blender. Yung araw mo na blender. Kaya ano kaya? So we're gonna go here to the beverage, coffee, cocktail, blending station. I have been. I plug mo naman. Pala, kailangan pala pina plug, guys. Mm. <laughs> Ganyan pala nagpo pour. Ganyan mag pour. Grabe naman po yan. It's making English now. Okay, if you could rate my smoothie this morning from 1 to 10, then. Uwe, gusto mo lang maging bate. Then, it's good. It's good. True. Masarap nga. Why don't you finish your drinks, man? It's I don't always like finishing the bottle. Okay. I don't like finishing the bottom of the drinks because it's always so saturated. Like, it's so puno at the bottom lagi of any drink. Any drink, period. Finish it. No matter but what, But you understand, period. you guys, comment down below. Like, you guys get me. No. no it's not right. When it's at the bottom of a drink, sobrang bap. You're wasting everything in here. You're wasting the apple, the banana, the... You're wasting so many stuff. I know. No excuses, just finish your drinks! <laughs> <laughs> Shall we return to the workout? Can we work out? Can you give me some space? <laughs> just, just like, just stay in the middle. Okay, continue. This is normal, by the way. She just likes the, the plopper. Actually, not in the middle. I just space go. Yeah. Okay. You were ready. You were ready. How was that we workout? Did it. it was hard because you've been out for a couple days. Yeah, hindi ka, hindi ako, hindi ako naging consistent for like three days because I've been non-stop editing. Like my heavy band became really heavy again. Yeah. It, it was already like, Getting easy. It was getting easy na, yeah. For me, it's just, we did the hike, we've been doing so many errands, and with a gloss drop coming in like tomorrow, parang I've been so tired. Even if the workout would have normally been easy, today was a push, but I'm glad we did it because it really sets me mentally. Like more than we did it, <laughs> we did it. But it really does set us mentally. Like more than the physical aspect, I just love. It's a, it's more of a mental thing, really. I love being able to start my day happy, you knowing I did it, na. Yeah. I always think, but in the pa when I go work out in the morning, I'm like, why, why, why? It's like constantly, why, why? Go out, dress up, go out. And I just like starting the day with endorphins because there is a psychological aspect to it, about right? Like eating healthy. It makes you feel good, you look good. good. Yeah, so it's really important. Hey guys, so I just finished showering. I usually do my skincare after I shower because I worked out and I just want to make sure that my skin is extra clean. I noticed when I started working out more, I got more blackheads and whiteheads and I think it's because you know, when you work out, you sweat and your pores are open. You really need to make the extra effort to cleanse. After you work out, I use the Perfect Whip Senka Face Wash. This is like less than 200 pesos long. Then I get my toner. This is from Kiehl's, the Ultra Facial Oil-Free Toner. And I just rub that baby on. This is to make sure that all the dirt is really absolved from my skin. I'm almost done now. I only ever really recommend products that I use because I feel like so many influencers are just cameras. Then I'm gonna moisturize in my room. Change into my loungewear. And now I usually just use aloe vera to moisturize my face throughout the day. It is a super cheap, it's like 100 pesos long, alternative to 
moisturize, really hydrates without all of the added chemicals and all that. Of course, if you have natural aloe vera, it's okay. I like this one especially because it is 99.85% aloe vera. Carbon-free, alcohol-free, and really lightweight compared to moisturizer. I noticed because I sweat so much during the day, so parang I don't want a moisturizer. So another one that I really like too, it's, it's the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Gel, which is nice if you're not on a budget. Um, but if you're on a budget, aloe vera will do swear. That is my like morning routine, my morning skincare routine, kind of how I start my days. I saw a lot of morning routines with like affirmations, journaling, a bunch of all that shit. But some days, I will say my affirmations or journal or whatever. It's really about like managing it. I feel it's hard to be consistent. Like every single day, you're gonna do all these little things. But I feel that as long as I eat clean, I work out, and I'm with my boo boo. It is, it is a good morning. So that's kind of how I start my day. I hope that helped you guys out. It's really just about eating good, feeling good, and starting my day like mentally happy and mentally prepared. So you wanna say thank you, Mumu? Na hindi na ligo. Yeah, she's gonna walk the dogs. Yeah, she's gonna watch walk the dogs. Thank you again for roasting me. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and. Comment down below other videos you want me to do. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!